Hey everybody, how's it going? I am Satham and welcome back to another video. Today, folks, I am going to be showing you how to make gasoline. So this is an ingredient required to run most electrical things and it does help because you can build end tier stuff. So if you folks enjoy this video, please do not forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and haven't already. And if you have just subscribed, remember to hit that bell icon so that you get notified when I upload new content. Also, if you have just subscribed, why not check out some of my other videos here on the channel? Who knows, you might just enjoy them. And for those who want to hang out or have questions about certain things in ARC, you can always find me on the Sethtopia Discord. Link to this can be found down below in the video's description, as well as in a pinned comment. So, in terms of making gasoline, you will need two things. Actually, you will need three. You will need oil, hide, fuel to burn, and a forge or an industrial forge. Now, oil can be obtained from oil nodes like this one behind me. This is on the island map, and it is located up north where you can see the white regions on the far upper left corner there are some islands that is where you will find the oil vein oil can also be obtained by killing certain creatures like for example the trilobites they will give a small amount of oil the two sows or giant squid will also give a form of oil they give ink which can be used as oil in the same way to create gasoline in terms of the oil nodes as you can see you can get oil by hitting it with a pick you can also use an ankylosaurus to gather oil however this time around for this video i am just going to use a pick just to show you guys how to get the oil once i've got a nice handful of oil i will then head off back to my base where i will cut back in and show you the exact process of making gasoline so I'll get a bit more oil from this and then I will cut out and see you folks in a little bit. Okay, so once you have the basic ingredients, you will need fuel for your forges. So either gasoline for the industrial forge or wood, thatch, uh, gunpowder and spark powder for the normal forge. Put in the oil and the hide and wait a bit and you shall get gasoline so obviously for the small forge i'm going to need some wood so i'll go and get some wood out of my vault and to craft five gasoline you will need five hide and six oil so those are the amount of items you'll need for five units of gasoline so i haven't got any wood i'm going to go and cut down some trees to get some wood for those that don't know if you want more wood use a hatchet as that way you'll get more wood and less thatch and if you use a metal pick you'll get more thatch and less wood so i personally want the wood because the wood will be turned into charcoal which can be used for other things such as crafting dyes and gunpowder so let's get that thing off also when you do go up north in the island or any snow biome region on any arc map you will need to make sure that you have some for armor equipped as being in the snow biomes will deplete your health quite quickly and you will die because you'll freeze to death so going back to the industrial forge we have already cooked up some gasoline from the materials that i have put in we're going to wait for this to happen in the smaller forge the difference between the industrial forge and the normal forge is that the industrial forge one can hold more items so you can craft much more gasoline but it also crafts it a lot faster whereas the normal forge does the exact same job however you have fewer slots and it crafts it at a slower speed there we go we already have five units of gasoline gasoline can be used to power a lot of things within your base as well as a few other things on aberration but that is for a different video so i'm going to show you what you can use to power gasoline we now have the industrial grinder this one requires gasoline to work as you can see 
you will have to turn it on. The industrial grill also requires gasoline to work. This is where you cook meat fast. So does the chemistry bench as well as the fabricator. Obviously, the generator will run on gasoline and will supply your base with electricity. And finally, the industrial cooker, which needs to be connected to water as well as use gasoline in order to cook things. The industrial cooker does the exact same as the campfire, only just like the industrial forge, it does it faster. You have more slots and because it is connected to a supply of water, you don't have to continuously refill your jars when you're making food and uh, kibbles. So as you can see, we have plenty of gasoline there. This one is taking a long while. And so that is how you make gasoline. With all that said, I do hope that you have found this video useful. If you have and enjoyed it, please do not forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more similar content. And if you have just subscribed, don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you get notified when I upload new content. Also, if you have just subscribed, why not check out some of my other videos here on this channel? Who knows, you might just enjoy them as I do all sorts of videos. For those who have more questions or just want to simply hang out with me, you can always find me on the Sethtopia Discord. And the link to this can be found down below in the video's description as well as in a pinned comment. Until next time, stay safe folks.